My name is Shadow Luigi, and welcome back to another Kingdom Hearts video, an actual one this time, because I'm not sure if you guys saw it, uh, previous video, but it was a bit of a, oh well, not a bit, it was a joke video, because uh, I had to redo this video, I'm not sure if you guys saw the, the, tw the, the Twitter, what the heck am I talking about, the uh, Instagram announcement video where the audio just sounded very bad, and I didn't like it, so <laughs> this is like part, this is like take three or so I don't know because I'm not sure if you guys want to count me actually doing the the joke video as part of it but whatever I guess either way regardless uh, yes we are back with Kingdom Hearts and today we are hopefully going to be facing off with the mysterious Oogie Boogie um, I'm pretty sure I said the exact same thing or something similar to it but yeah uh, this is some heartless along the way and uh, be careful don't fall, like I just did. It's very easy to fall off here, which is why I don't like fighting here. It's kind of annoying. Well, we're just going to do that heartless then. Uh, do I want to... Here's the thing, I get... Uh... Oh, Jack got him. Alrighty then. Well, into the evil playroom we shall go, because those little kids uh, stole the heart thing for Oogie Boogie. Yeah, it's just literally that's the only thing and honestly the probably the best feeling you can get from these kids straight up robbing you, you literally just beat them. Can you imagine that? Like just someone with um, a giant thing with a crab. And because they wouldn't know what a key plate is, so this is definitely something very weird and she's like almost dead what the heck goofy stop <laughs> we're already beating them we're just following orders oogie boogie told us to steal the heart it's all barrel's fault it was his idea to tell oogie boogie about the heart yeah that's right but you guys said you should be ashamed. Yeah, I like how they just pin the blame on just one person because it totally wasn't their fault. And uh, yeah, uh, you guys could save. I already have a save file, so we're just gonna continue on. And um, I'm gonna be reloading the previous save file. So in order to uh, talk to or get to Uki, I completely forgot what to. Uh, hold up, just hit that. That way, when we walk out. Uh, it lets us do some more stuff. I I don't know why I thought I was going to be playing the cutscene. Um, there are some things we can get, some chests. But in order to get to Oogie Boogie the quickest, I'll uh, just pretty much run in there. So, I believe you... Oh, yeah. Over here. Uh, a chest. Pick this up. Some more Dalmatians, which are always welcome. And there are a few chests around here. I will be picking them all up because... Um, oh, wait, hold up. There's an enemy. Uh, got thunder. That, yeah, no, my magic set is probably the worst. No, there's some chests. Uh, we're going to be picking them up because... It's just free items, and we don't want to be missing out on free items. Okay, so to pretty much traverse through this area, just try to walk around, and then there should be some spots. I don't believe this is one of them. Uh, that allow you to just pretty much teleport around. Let's see if I can find something like that. Let me jump, jump down here. Some more heartless. Why are there any chests? Right here? Uh, there's a chest down there. Ow. Okay. Uh. Oh. All right. Just jump down. I thought there was something to. Oh. Open it. Oh, I know the things right there. But us, we just like jump through. I didn't even know that actually. Who would think with my expertise? I'm not an expert in, <laughs> in this game at all. But uh. 
Yeah, there's another chest right here with an Ori Calcum. Pick that up. Like, seriously, just pick it up. Okay, uh, right here. The quickest way to get to Oogie. Yes. Just go through that door. And then Oogie's door will be right there, but I don't feel like going in there yet. One, I need some more magic, and I've taken quite a bit of damage, so uh, I'll just cut until these heartless are all dead. Alrighty, well, I was just pretty much um, walking around just trying to find some more chests, but uh, there are none, so I guess we could just head down right here. Uh, I don't know where Oogie is. Oh, no, yeah, right over here. Yeah, no, uh, there's just those three chests. And, uh, make sure you pick up the Ori Calco. We need that. Either way, let's just head inside the, the torture chamber. I know I want, I said I wanted more magic, but, uh, yeah, no, some fights just sort of got in the way. And plus, we have some items as well. This Actually, help. let me just... Let me equip some of those items, because... We need some magic back, so let's get some ethers. Uh, no, I'm not giving any of the items to any of the party characters. I'm not sure if I mentioned this, but giving them items uh, just doesn't really work well. I guess one more makeup potion won't hurt. And then, let's see. Yeah, no, I'll just end up using some more ethers, just because I don't want to waste any of the elixirs or the uh, mega ethers right now. So, yeah. Alrighty then. Now that. Uh, wait, sorry. One. I forget, I, I could use one uh, right now. Just so that I can get some magic back. Alright. Now that we are capped off for right now, let's go head into the torture chamber. Where are you, Oogie? Oogie Boogie. Oogie Boogie. Give me back that heart. Or the heart. I can read. You want it? Well then, come on over and get it! Ah! <laughs> now, let's see if I can get their attention! Oh, hi, boys! This is it? Nobody disrespects me! Nobody! Okay, uh, so I'm not sure if that's gonna pop up, but <laughs> hopefully not. Oh gosh. Uh, the Oogie Boogie boss fight. Uh, a little challenging if you don't know what you're doing like I was, uh, first recording. So, there are some things about Oogie. Uh, there is gonna be these light things that light up. Uh, you want to make sure you get the one where he is at and be careful because he likes to troll He likes to move around and if you get the wrong one um, It's just gonna spin you all the way around to these things uh, You don't need to worry about them. Just like jump at the right moment and you won't be taking any damage and Oogie for his point of damage. He just He just summons some dice and these ones are a lot easier to hit uh, hit those back They give random uh, effects or just some of the enemies depending on how many there are and which ones land uh, I don't know the exact uh, calculations or the exact things but I don't think you need to worry too much as long as you hit a few back and uh, yeah no be careful just trying to catch up with them and then you'll be able to do some damage and let me just get up here not letting me get up here. Okay, you know what? Just, just do some magic, I guess, for right here. You should be able to get up here. I don't know why it's not letting me, but it's fine. We can do some damage. And I already ran out of magic. Dear gosh. Okay. I mean, go ahead and launch his back, but it's not going to be doing much. Yeah, surprisingly, he does not have a ton of health. And... Ow. You know, I like to just not to be um, targeted when he throws dice, it's a lot easier to be hit. And this is pretty much the boss fight, I know it's not too intriguing I 
guess. Oh, okay. Uh, let me lock onto him so I can find out where he's going. And be careful, because sometimes he likes to bait you. He, like makes you think he's going one way, but in reality he's going so wrong. That is dumb. What? What do you mean? You hardly did like any damage. I guess this is like a certain uh, threshold that we're able to attack for different periods of time. Oh gosh. Okay. Uh, so we gotta be careful right here. Ow. Alright. So, there are two different versions of this uh, specific one of those blades just sort of going around. There's one where it's just spinning like normal, and then the other one where it's basically jumping, so you have to be careful with that one. Yeah, let me just do that. Yeah, I, I'm just assuming there's a certain amount of uh, damage we can actually do on him. Oh, uh, and here's the other one I was talking about. Uh, be careful. I think he just activates it during around this part of the fight because he gets desperate. Let me just. Uh, I thought I could block those, but I guess hitting it is the best way to go. And yeah, right there, he tried to. I'm not sure if you guys saw, but he tried to juke us out. But uh, yeah, no, that's not gonna work. Boogie, and I don't know why I can't get the Sonic Frame from here. But whatever. He's almost dead. And I believe you can hit him with the... Uh, Will that even kill him though? Okay, I hit one. Doesn't mean I want that to... Oh wait, when he does that, you're able to hit them again. But I wasn't paying attention. Did he just dab on me? Oh yeah, we could still hurt him with our magic. So I guess you could do that. But... It's best not to waste that much. Oh gosh, he's healing. I forget about that. If you don't hit some of the dice, uh, he can heal. Which is a bit annoying, and I don't want to get him right here. One, two... Nope. I want you to go... Okay, well, I guess we're gonna have to stop him right here. I didn't want to because I can't reach him. Thunder. I don't want to waste my magic, but... Oh gosh, no, I'm sorry for not... Oh, there we go, we got up! This takes a lot of effort with that high jump. Yeah, uh, not a difficult boss fight. So, that heart was a failure after all. Obtain the Holy Circlet. And Ansem's Report Number 7. How did he get so big? Look, it's brimming with the power of darkness. Yeah, uh, literally just uh, Oogie Boogie is drawing power from those dark globs. He gets darkness pimples. Just so we just have to destroy those things, right? Yes, that's literally all we have to do now. Uh, this boss fight, this part of the boss fight is probably uh, easier. It's not really that hard. Uh, be careful with the blobs, they do. Um, defend themselves, and I believe one of the first ones are around here, I think. No, we just gotta park our way up there, and I believe there is one that is a bit tricky, or at least it was tricky for me to find my first time around, because I remember just, uh, just missing it entirely. Okay, well, I guess we gotta jump up here, and all the path fighting is kinda weird, not gonna lie, but... Just make sure you destroy these little pimples, and um, that's pretty much 
gonna be the boss fight. There's another one right here. I believe this is the one I had trouble finding. I just sort of strayed from the path at some point. But hey, what do you expect from a first time player? I guess a lot because many people are just too good at this game or they just spend way too much time playing this game as a child. There's one more right here. Just keep on following me and you should be able to get this done with relative ease. Um, there should be some Heartless that do spawn, but other than that, just this thing right here could be doing most of the damage and you know, I don't want to be targeting on the Heartless, they're just sort of unnecessary. Don't even bother. Take too much damage, you have some potions, or at least you should have some equipped, and I almost completely ignore this one. I know it. I don't know. Just, it kind of... It doesn't necessarily blend in. I think I just don't notice some of the smaller details of some things. And, uh, yeah, be careful. Some of these stairs, they move. Anyway, just head back up here, and this should be the last one. It's not a lot. It's just... Um, getting it. This is what takes most of the time. Uh, I missed one. Okay. Uh, then it should be this one that I missed. Uh, my first time so it should be around here. Ow. Okay, uh, I don't die. Oh, it's right here. Okay, there we go. Found it with uh, quick ease, I guess. Uh, I think this is the one I had trouble finding the other time, just because it's a bit out of your path. But nothing too bad. Hit him before we leave! Let's go! Power of the star. Gravity has been upgraded to Gravira. Will I ever use it? Probably not. Sally, why didn't I listen to you? Don't feel bad, Jack. We'll come up with another plan for Halloween. Next time, we'll do it together. Well, isn't that just sweet? I guess we have no choice. We'll have to cancel the Heartless Halloween Festival for now. Here, I want you to have this. And he gives us probably the coolest looking Keyblade, the Pumpkin Head. Visit us anytime, Sora. Next year's Halloween will be the scariest ever! Emotions, memory, we put in all the necessary ingredients. What else do you need to make a heart? What is a heart anyway? I can't figure it out. Yeah, uh, that's, that's pretty much it. Uh, also, right here, examine. You get a torn page. I forgot to collect it the other time. It's just right there. Just look at it. Collect it. And, uh, yeah. Uh, Jack's still gonna be following us, but uh, there are a few things I want to get done while we are here. Mainly just collect some chests. Or, actually... No, you know, we're, we're gonna save it for next time. Just... My artificial heart should have been a huge success, but it was a huge failure. I can't figure out what went wrong. I don't know. How's my voice for that, by the way? I, I don't know. I, I think it's pretty good. I don't really remember how his voice sounded, so I'm just sort of making it up on the fly. I think that one suits him perfectly. And, of course, as of right now, since we completely finished off this area, uh, there aren't gonna be any heartless spawning. There are a few chests we can pick up, but uh, To be honest, we're gonna be coming back here later because there's some of them that we cannot get right now, but before we leave Get pumpkin head not wishing star pumpkin head if you're going for more of a magic build uh, I'm sorry, but I prefer physical damage and pumpkin head is the best 
And also we could get some more uh, defense, but I'll just be using Ray of Light. I mean, you could use the Holy... Mm. Actually... You know, let's go with this one. Let's get the Holy Circuit. And uh, I want to use Ray of Light, but honestly, it's only 3 HP, and it kind of drops down the rest of our stats, so... Who cares? I mean, I'm pretty sure there's a better way to optimize all this stuff, but it's fine. And look at that. Pretty long keyboard. So, more range equals more damage. Anyway, yeah, we're just gonna be heading out. Make sure you save. And, uh, yeah, those guys are just gonna be there. So, I'll see you guys when we're traveling. Because, honestly, you guys already seen the world map. Alrighty then, so now we are heading towards the next area, and yes, dummy ship sections are back, but there are a few things I want to talk to you about. Um, so in terms of the Kingdom Hearts series, I know I've been very, very slow with uploads recently just because work has been killer. Like, very, very killer. I don't know why I'm sounding like that. Uh, I think I've just been watching too many other YouTubers, so I end up talking like them. I'm sorry. <laughs> so yeah, but work has been really killer recently. And I don't know, it's very hard to get something out because Yeah, it's work. It's what happens when you grow up young children. You gotta pay for stuff. You have to pay for things that you want. It it sucks, I know. And I'm hopefully I'm just I don't know. Because, like, for me to come back and record, it's just, it's kind of hard. Just a little bit. And this dummy section is not too difficult. And let me see if I can kill this guy. Nope. He just almost killed me. Okay, nice. Uh, I shouldn't be dying here. Okay, there we go. Got some armor. More shells. I don't really expect to be making a custom dummy ship anytime soon. I don't know. If you guys want me to, uh, I will. And uh, one more thing, something I'm considering doing, I know I don't normally ask you guys for like likes or um, subscriptions, I mean subscribe if you want to, like if you want to, but uh, I believe I want to try something. If this video alone gets 20 likes, I know I'm asking for a lot here, but <laughs> um, if this video gets 20 likes, I will get the next video out when I can. But I'll be recording a second one immediately after. So that way I can have two videos completely edited and ready to go. Perhaps not on the same day, I don't know. But we will see. I will get definitely have two videos out by the time. Or if this video gets 20 likes. I mean, I probably should be doing that regardless, but I don't know, we'll see, we'll see. Or perhaps three videos if this video alone gets 20 likes. Oh a big ship is catching up to us. Quick! Wait, hold on. Quick, Gaki! That's a pirate ship! Uh, I, that sounds like a horrible Donald impression. I know. It's going to ram us! Hold on tight! Yeah, no, I'm sorry, but, uh, we'll see. I didn't think you'd come, Sora. <gasps> Good to see you again. Well, where are Donald and Goofy? Are they that important to you? More important than old friends? Instead of worrying about them, you should be asking about her. Kyrie! That's right. While you were off goofing around, I finally found her. Not so fast! No shenanigans aboard my vessel, boy. Riku, why are you siding with the Heartless? The Heartless obey me now, Sora. Now I have nothing to fear. You're stupid! Sooner or later they'll swallow your heart! Not a chance. My heart's too strong. Riku! I've picked up a few other tricks as well. Like this, for instance. You can go see your friends now. Ah! Let's get underway already. 
and keep Sora away from Kairi until we're ready to land. Hmm. That scurvy brat thinks he can order me around. What shall we do, Captain Hook? Nothing! The hold is crawling with heartless. Let them keep an eye on the brats. But, Captain, you know who is also down... Shh! Did you hear that, me? Oh, that dreadful sound. No, Captain. Are you quite sure? Did I imagine it? Oh, my poor nerves. You don't say. Yeah, it was definitely Kyrie. I finally found her. All right. <laughs> yep. Then let's go up and talk to her. Yeah. Sounds good. Okay, but first, how about getting off? Oh, <laughs> sorry. <clears throat> how you doing there? Looking for a way out? Who are you? I'm the answer to your prayers. <sighs> okay then, fine, have it your way. But you're stuck in here too, aren't you? Huh, nope, I'm just waiting for someone. Who? Tinkerbell, what took you so long? Great job, so you found Wendy? Hold on, there was another girl there too? Are you crazy? There's no way I'm gonna leave Wendy there. Uh -huh. She must be pretty jealous. <laughs> Come on, Tink. Open up the door. <clears throat> hmm. I'm Peter Pan. I'm Sora. Okay. We're in this together, but only till we find Wendy. Alrighty then, you jerk. Alright, well, this time I am getting rid of Goofy for Peter Pan. Uh, why am I taking Donald? Who cares? <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> no, yeah, but uh, actually, uh, I'm thinking about it. How about this? If this video reaches 20 likes, I will get the next video as soon as possible and a live stream. Just, I don't know, just a live stream on. I don't know, I'll let you guys choose. YouTube or Twitch, whichever one you guys would prefer. But I feel like it would be fun. And the live stream, um, I will try to make it at least an hour and 30 minutes. You know, a pretty good, decent sized live stream. But I don't know, that's for you guys to decide. Will this video reach 20 likes? Who knows? I might be asking for a bit too much. But I will try to get the next video out as soon as possible, just regardless of. Um, deal or not but either way guys that's pretty much gonna do it for this episode of kingdom hearts in the next video we will be traversing through the uh, captain hook's pirate ship in neverland i uh, haven't seen peter pan uh that's fine i guess but i suggest you go watch it it's really good i i liked it a lot watching it as a kid and also he can fly it's pretty cool either way guys that's pretty much gonna do it for this video my name is shadow luigi and i'll see you guys in the next video